Have you ever wondered how we keep time in sync with Earth's slowing rotation? Well, it's not as simple as you might think. We actually have to add a leap second every few years to keep our clocks in check. Or how about this? Do you know how sometimes you notice a flicker in your peripheral vision? That's because your brain processes light differently there. Almost like you've got a fly's eye view of the world. And speaking of strange, did you know time moves slower at the Earth's core than it does on the surface? Time isn't just a straight line. It's a mind-bending maze of paradoxes and peculiarities that shape our reality in ways you've never imagined. I mean, it's all wibbly-wobbly and timey-wimey as well. I'm Mike with this 25 and here are 25 facts about time that'll completely change your perspective. Enough of those. <laughs> 25. Your language shapes your sense of time. Did you know the way you talk can change how you perceive time? In English, we use phrases like, ah, oh, it's been a long time, or we'll catch up shortly, like time is a path we're walking on. But in Greek and Spanish, people think of time more like something that piles up. They might say, it's been a lot of time since we last saw each other. This tiny difference doesn't just change how we talk, it changes how we see the world. And if you're bilingual, you get the best of both worlds. Scientists have actually found that bilinguals can switch between these different ways of thinking just by switching languages. 24. Time can eventually run out. The universe isn't just growing, it's getting older too. And that means time is changing along with it. Right now, time moves forward thanks to something called the arrow of time, which began with the Big Bang. It's all about entropy, basically how messy things get. When the universe was young, everything was pretty tidy. But as it ages, things get more chaotic. Like how cracking an egg is easy, but putting it back together? Not so much. One day, when everything reaches maximum chaos, time might just stop moving altogether. No past, no future, just a frozen universe. 23. You're a time traveler. Just not the sci-fi kind. Is time travel possible? Absolutely. You're doing it right now cruising into the future one second at a time. Whether you're stuck in traffic or enjoying time with friends, you're always moving forward at the same steady pace. But that's not the kind of time travel that gets moviegoers excited. Sci-fi stories like Back to the Future and Doctor Who take things to a whole new level, with characters hopping into fancy machines to visit the past or future. While these stories love exploring what happens when you mess with the timelines, no one's actually figured out how to pull off this kind of time hopping without, you know, getting obliterated. Even Stephen Hawking joked that if time travel were possible, we'd already have tours from the future clogging up the present. For now, science has shown that time can bend a little, like how astronauts age a bit slower in space, but those sci-fi dreams are still just that. Dreams. 22. Time feels different for everyone. Have you ever noticed how time flies for some people, but drags for others? It's not just about being bored or excited, I'll, I'll get to that later. It turns out our brains just don't see time the same way. Stuff like how we were raised, our culture, and even where we live can change how we experience it. The phenomenon is known as inter-individual differences in perception. So if you're at a party that seems to end too soon, but someone else thinks it's dragging, it's not just about having fun, it's just your brain doing its own thing. 21. Why time drags when you have unfinished business? Do you ever find yourself obsessing over that one thing you didn't finish? It's called the Zygarnik effect. Your brain just can't let it go, which is why those incomplete projects keep popping into your head even when you're trying to relax. This mental nagging doesn't just mess with your focus, it can actually make time feel like it's stretching out. The more your mind loops back to that unfinished business, the longer it seems to take. You may find that delaying a half-done task isn't just frustrating, but it can also drag on for quite some time. Hey guys, just jumping in here real quick to tell you some exciting news. You know how you love watching our videos for amazing facts? Well, what if I told you that you could also have 500 amazing facts in the palm of your hand? That's right, we wrote a book. This one right here. What the facts are you talking about? And you can order it right now and have List 25 right in your library or on your coffee table or wherever it is you keep your books. It's available right now on Amazon, so click the link in the description and grab yourself and friends and family a copy today. 20. Our emotions also mess with our sense of time. 
Feelings like anger, sadness, or fear can completely distort how you perceive time. Researchers have found that this happens because emotions tweak two main factors, arousal, high-low, and pleasantness, positive-negative. High energy emotions, whether positive or negative, can make time seem to speed up. Meanwhile, low energy emotions can slow things down. So next time you're having a blast and hours disappear in what feels like minutes, or you're feeling low and the day just seems endless, it's not just your imagination. It's your emotions messing with your sense of time. Damn you inside out. <laughs> 19. The Holiday Paradox Do you remember a time when you felt your vacation ended in a flash, but looking back it seemed like you were gone for months? That is the Holiday Paradox in action. It's this strange feeling where a holiday seems to whiz by while you're living it, but it feels much longer when you remember it later. Psychologists explain this by how we experience time in two ways. Prospectively, in the moment, and retrospectively, looking back. Normally, these two perspectives match up, but when we're on vacation, the flood of new experiences throws them out of sync. During our regular routines, time is measured by familiar markers like work hours or bedtimes. But on vacation, the constant novelty distorts our sense of time, making it feel both short and long at the same time. 18. Anticipation seriously slows things down. I told you we'd cycle back to this one. Remember counting down the days to Christmas or Hanukkah or that long-awaited holiday as a kid? Yep, that's the unnecessary power of anticipation, in my opinion anyway. When you're excited about something big in your future, whether it's a vacation or a big event, time just seems to slow down. Every day feels longer and longer because you're so focused and excited about what's coming. So if you know the feeling, you're not alone. Anticipation is a sneaky way of slowing everything down. 17. Routine makes time fly by. As we get older, time seems to speed up, right? Our brains love patterns. They make life easier. When you're repeating the same tasks every day, like your commute or your morning coffee ritual, your brain goes on autopilot. It saves mental energy, but it also makes you less aware of time passing. The more predictable your routine, the faster time seems to fly. This explains why, before you know it, whole chunks of your life have disappeared while you were going about your daily routine. 16. Your brain isn't the only one keeping time. We all know the brain loves to mess with our sense of time, even when we're not really thinking about it. But guess what? Your heart's in on it too. In 2023, researchers at Cornell found that our hearts play a role in how we perceive time without us even knowing. They brought 45 students in, hooked them up to some fancy equipment, and had them listen to different beeps. The weird part? When their heartbeats were shorter, they thought the beeps were longer. And when their heartbeats were longer, the beeps seemed shorter. Incredibly, we can subtly sense time through the heart's rhythm, even in those incredibly fast moments we don't notice consciously. 15. Time flies when you're plugged in. Have you ever found yourself in a three-hour internet deep dive after doing a simple Google search? Or realized how one YouTube video became 20 and suddenly it's 3 a.m.? Time slips through our fingers when we're glued to our screens. And while books can do the same thing, technology seems to turbocharge the effect. Ethel McLaughlin's research at James Cook University suggests that tech use might be speeding up our internal clock. We're processing information faster, which is great for productivity, but can make us feel more pressured by time. So while we are getting more done, we're also stressing out more. Ironically, we're too busy using tech to notice the extra time it supposedly gives us. The solution? Maybe it's time for a digital detox, or at least a tech break every now and then. 14. Time warps through eye contact. A 2021 study from the University of Geneva found that intense eye contact can make us perceive time differently. In the experiment, volunteers watched short video clips of strangers looking directly into the camera. Some held an intense gaze while others glanced away for a brief moment. Although all the clips were under one and a half seconds long, participants perceived the intense stares as being shorter than they actually were. It's almost as if a focused gaze can compress time, making the moment feel fleeting. <laughs> Just keep this going for as long as I can. How long did that feel? <laughs> 13, the tempo trap. As if our minds and hearts didn't already play enough tricks on us, 
Music adds another layer of confusion to our sense of time. Fast-paced, upbeat music can make time feel like it's flying by, while slow, somber tunes can stretch out our perception of each second. One study found that participants overestimated the duration of time while listening to arousing soundtracks like happy or scary music compared to neutral or no music at all. The phenomenon can even affect how we experience waiting times or movies, where an intense soundtrack can make a scene feel much longer or shorter than it actually is. 12. Sleep's Strange Time Warp Just like how music can manipulate our perception of time, sleep, or the lack of it to be more precise, can also bend our internal clock. Sleep deprivation tends to make us overestimate time, making minutes drag on like hours. This isn't just because we're tired. Being sleep deprived disrupts our brain's ability to process time accurately, skewing our perception. Studies even show that lack of sleep can mess with our circadian rhythms, which naturally regulate how we perceive time throughout the day. 11. The Smoke-Free Time Warp Kicking the habit of smoking brings a slew of withdrawal symptoms, like irritability, restlessness, and a foggy mind, but one surprising side effect is the inability to gauge time accurately. A 2003 study from Penn State University revealed that when smokers go without nicotine for just 24 hours, their time perception goes haywire. During a simple test, nicotine-deprived smokers overestimated 45 seconds by an incredible 50%, while non-smokers and active smokers nailed the timing. This skewed sense of time could be why ex-smokers, much like the sleep-deprived, struggle with performance in their personal and professional lives. It's hard to stay on track when your brain is misreading the clock. 10. Novelty slows down time. Whenever we encounter something new, our brain takes longer to process it, making time seem slower. In an experiment by the neuroscientist David Eagleman, participants who watched a slow-motion video of a cheetah perceived time as 27% shorter compared to those who watched it at normal speed. The reason? There was less new information for the brain to process. The same applies to seeing the same image repeatedly, but a brand new image seems to last longer. In short, the more novel an experience, the more our brain stretches time to take it all in. 9. Editing time with film cuts Did you know that how a movie is edited can actually mess with your sense of time? A study from 2023 looked into this with two types of editing styles, continuity and discontinuity. Continuity editing keeps everything in the same context. Think of a couple chatting at a restaurant, then a shot of their waiter bringing the food. Discontinuity, on the other hand, jumps around, like suddenly cutting from that restaurant scene to a dog sprinting on the beach. In the end, people watching the continuity edited clips thought they lasted longer than the ones with discontinuous cuts or no cuts at all. Researchers think it's because our brains have to work harder to keep up with the story when the angle changes, but the scene stays the same. With discontinuity, the obvious shift in scenes gives our brain a breather, so it ends up making time feel shorter. 8. Spring forward, fall back. Spring forward, fall back is a handy little reminder for adjusting our clocks during daylight saving time, or DST. In spring, we move the clocks ahead by an hour to squeeze out more evening daylight, and in fall, we set them back to get that extra hour of sleep. While this change sounds simple, it can actually mess with our internal clocks. That hour difference can leave people feeling like they've got a mini case of jet lag, struggling to adjust to the new schedule. Although DST is meant to make better use of daylight, the sudden shift can disrupt our routines and leave us wondering why time seems to be playing tricks on us twice a year. Uh, let me know in the comments below your thoughts on daylight savings time. I personally like when it gets darker earlier. That's just me. Especially again, I've mentioned this before, Disney at night is one of the best places and the fact that we barely get, what, an hour of nighttime Disney before the parks close is ridiculous. Especially Animal Kingdom. How do you have an entire land dedicated to, uh, not photosynthesis, what am I saying? Bioluminescence, Avatar Land, and you get like 30 minutes of it. Hashtag keep Animal Kingdom open longer. 6 p.m. is nuts, especially during daylight savings time. Sorry, rant over. Seven. Our fleeting existence in time. When you consider the universe's timeline, our presence is just a tiny blip. In fact, if we condensed all of history into one year, with the Big Bang happening at midnight on January 1st, the dinosaurs wouldn't go extinct until December 29th. Humanity's entire history would barely make it into the last few minutes of December 31st, with modern humans showing up at around 11.54 p.m. We've been around for such a short time in the grand scheme of things that it's almost mind-boggling. 
The universe has been unfolding for 13.8 billion years, and we are just newcomers, arriving right at the end of the party. Six, timekeeping in space. Time gets a bit weird on the International Space Station. Astronauts up there witness a sunrise or sunset every 45 minutes as they orbit Earth, so sticking to a single time zone is crucial to avoid complete chaos. While new crew members arrive on Kazakhstan time, thanks to their launch from the Baikonur Cosmodrome, the ISS operates on coordinated universal time, the same as Greenwich Mean Time. This gives everyone a shared reference point, no matter how fast they're zooming around the planet. After all, it's hard enough to keep track of time here on Earth, let alone if you're circling it every 90 minutes. Five, the rhythm of time. Time is all about repetition. To measure it, we just need something that repeats itself in a predictable pattern. Take the start of a new day. It happens because Earth completes a rotation on its axis. Then there's the moon, going through its phases as it orbits around us, and even the seasons, changing as we orbit around the sun. These natural cycles have been our timekeepers for ages, helping us track everything from days to months to years. It's absolutely incredible to think that the rhythms we live by today, like watching the sunrise or celebrating the start of spring, are the same ones humans have used to mark the passage of time for thousands and thousands of years. Four, the fastest particle and time dilation. Back in 1991, scientists discovered a particle so fast they could do nothing but name it the Oh my God particle. It was just a fraction slower than the speed of light and packed as much energy as a baseball traveling at 100 kilometers an hour. An incredible feat for something so small. Now, while its speed was out of this world, <laughs> see what I did there? It also demonstrated a wild concept, time dilation. In short, when things move that fast, time actually slows down for them compared to us. So although this particle rocketed through space in seconds, it would have experienced time much differently. Picture a blockbuster sci-fi time warp, bending and stretching in ways explained only by Einstein's theory of relativity. It's an exhilarating reminder of just how flexible time can get at the edge of physics. Three, time has a different beat at the Earth's core. Time actually ticks slower in the Earth's core than it does here on the surface. It's all because of gravity and the way it bends space-time. The deeper you go into Earth's gravity well, the stronger the space-time curvature gets. Even though there's zero gravitational pull at the very center, you'd be weightless in every direction, the effect on time is still there. This happens because gravity isn't just a force, it's also a shape, bending space and time around it. So while we're all busy living our days up here on the surface, the core is in its own little time zone, running just a bit slower. Two, what the world looks like in fly time. Flies experience time in a way that's completely different than us. With the ability to see up to 250 flashes of light per second, compared to our measly 60, they're basically living in a slow motion world. This superpower allows them to process information at lightning speed, making them almost impossible to swat. <laughs> and you can forget catching one with chopsticks like in the Karate Kid. One, timekeeping in sync. Every few years, the top timekeepers add a leap second to our clocks to keep them in sync with Earth's slow rotation. It might seem like splitting hairs, but it's the only way to keep our time accurate. Without it, even a tiny mismatch would slowly add up, throwing off precise measurements and causing issues for systems that rely on spot-on timing. Essentially, the leap second makes sure our concept of time doesn't drift away from the reality of our planet's movements, showing that sometimes even a single second can make all the difference. And that's it for today's temporal twists. But if you're craving even more reality bending facts, I've got just the thing. Have you ever heard of a man tall enough to save dolphins with his bare hands? Or someone whose nose is so sharp they can sniff out Parkinson's? How about the fact that you can actually see your own white blood cells darting around? <laughs> yeah, reality is just as weird as time. So take the time <laughs> to click on the link right here to watch our video on 25 mind twisting facts that'll challenge your reality. You will never look at life the same again. And I will catch you next time. <laughs> All right, I'm done. <laughs> or am I? I'm done.